hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel uh, in this video i'll be sharing you the final year project which i had done in my eighth semester so this is the code of the project so i'll just run this particular code i'll just click on to the new terminal over here and i'll just select it as command shell so i need to activate the folder first so i'll just run this particular command script slash activate so once the project is activated i'll just go inside the cd project directory then i'll just run the server python manage.py run server so once i run this particular command i'll be getting a starting development server where i can run the project so i'll just press ctrl and i'll just click on to this particular link so you can see the home page has been visible over here so this is the project so where we have the home and we can do the scraping over here and uh, we can just get the particular predictions of it and we can uh, do the authentication system in it so what i'll do here is the first part is the scraping part over here so until and unless i won't log in i won't be authenticated to use this particular page so what i'll be doing here is first i'll do the sign up and the sign up so the particular email you need to give it as a valid email over here so what i'll be giving here is the email address i'll just give it as erk recorder at gmail.com so once i give the email i'll just give the password over here so this particular password should match with each other so once I sign in, so you can say I'll be getting a uh, link like activate your account by clicking link on your email. So what I need to give, I need to just go to the particular email address and I need to verify the particular email of it. So I'll just select the Google account. I'll just click on to the Gmail. So once I open the particular Gmail over here, so you can see I'll be getting a activate your account link. So I'll just click on to this particular uh, particular link over here, the particular uh, message. So I'll just click on to the activation link. So once I click on to the activation link, you can see account activated successfully. So now I can log in with this particular account. So I'll just tell ARK Procoder at gmail.com and I'll just give the particular email address. So once I give the email, you can see I'm getting a logout option over here. So if I just click on to the logout, you can see I'll be getting logout success from here. So even I can reset the particular link. So you need to give the particular email address of it to get the particular uh, link. So to get to reset the password, so I'll just give this particular uh, Gmail account. So once I submit, you can see we'll, we have sent you an activation with an instructions on how to reset a password. So if I just again, if I just go back to the same email, so you can see I'll be getting one more uh, link to reset the password. So I can just set it the new password over here. So I'll just uh, set it something like differently. So you can see I'll just uh, select this one and I'll just uh, paste it. So if I just submit it, you can see a password has been reset success. Please log in with the new password. Now, if I try to log in with the old password, it, it won't be giving me the authentication to log in it. So if I just uh, give something like, so you can see if I just use the old password over here, you can see I'm getting invalid credentials, but I need to give the same password which I have been used over here. If I just go back, I'll just give the password which I have been used right now. So if I just log in it with the new password, you can see I'm getting a uh, thing like uh, I'm getting the particular uh, home page. So once I logged in successfully. So if I, the first part in this particular website is what to the aim is what here is to just we will be scraping the Google Maps data. So all those like the particular location wise, the data will get stored into the CSV file that is in the Excel sheets as well as in the database. Then we will be doing the predictions. Like uh, we'll be doing pre-processing and we'll use apply the random forest and canyon predictions to get the particular business uh, success uh, rate over here. So the first part is what here is. I'll just click on to the scraping. So here you can see we have medicals and restaurant. We have done for the two parts. That is the medicals and restaurant. We can just uh, scrape it for the medicals as well as the restaurants. The main thing, the first question is here is what is the uh, particular uh, data set as an input you are providing it to provide a data set as an input. So we need to go with the administration over here. So if I just go to the slash admin with this URL, so as I am just a normal user, I can access only the website and the functionalities, but I cannot access the administration over here. So if I just give the administration part, the administration credentials. So if I log in with the administrations, so you can see I have the tables over here. So that is the add locations URL as well as a Google Maps scraping data and the locations names over here. So if I try to add the location URLs, that is nothing but if I just click on to the scraping over here, you can see we have a number of uh, places names. So Vijayapura, Devanahalli, Hebbar, all those things. If you want to add any location particularly, 
so i can just go to this uh, locations names i can add any of the location so i can just add something like a uh, location i can add it as uh chikbalapura okay can just add this uh, location so once i add it if i just come back and uh, refresh it you can see i'm getting as a chikbalapura over here so same way if i if i just uh, delete this particular uh, location it will get deleted from the home page i can just uh, delete the particular uh, location also suppose we have added this many so if i just refresh the page again so you can see the particular uh, location is been gone so now if suppose i want to add any of the for the data set suppose the main thing of the data set is what here is we will be going to the google maps in the where is it here is a map so if i want to add the particular in the chikbalapura so here is everyone one chikbalapura so if i want to add the medicals of the chikbalapura so what i'll be doing here is i'll just go to this home page so in the administration so here we have a option add locations url so i'll just click on to it so here you can see i have added a number of the data set so we have added for the bell road and we have added for the uh, sultan palla we have added for the elanka suppose if i want to select for the bell road you can see i have added the locations of the place like just i am adding the location this is the uh, input which will be taken now uh, by our uh, website as an input to scrape the particular location details so you can see we have a restaurants and medicals so if i just select it as a restaurant so these are all the restaurants that we have added these many uh, locations we have added so if i want to scrape for it it will just scrape all the locations data and it will store into our database that is nothing but it will be storing into this google maps scraping data you can see so once the data is get scraped you can see it will be stored in this particular manner so address will get rating total reviews number website category area status as well as popular times when it is open all those things you can see all the data has been scraped and it will be stored in say, in this particular format so let's uh, try for one so what i was trying to say here is now suppose i want to add chikbalapura medical so i'll just tell chikbalapura karnataka so if i just select it as this one so here i'll just uh, say it as medicals m e d s e l s medicals okay so if i just uh, select it as a chikbalapura medicals if i just uh, enter it so you can see we have uh, all the medicals will be getting shiva medicals global medicals and all those things so to add the input just i need to select this particular uh, location so i need to just copy this url so once i copy this url so i need to provide the data set so i'll just click on to the home page and i'll just say add location urls so i'll just add the locations urls for the location what for the location chikbalapura and the location the particular type is medical so i'll just paste the particular link and i'll just save it so you can see the data is getting saved over here so along with that same thing i need to do for what so second uh, so for this particular global medicals so if i click on the global medicals i need to copy the url of it and i'll just come back to the here and i need to add one more uh, data set for the chikbalapura it is a medicals and if i just save it just paste it and save it so now if i just select the chikbalapura that is only the medicals you can see we have two medicals added over here so now i can scrape it for this two particular location same way so let's uh, try for this particular uh, uh, sultan palya now so let's try it for this particular detail so where we have uh, medicals over here we have a 14 urls data set i have been added before so let's try to scrap for this particular 14 details now so if i just come back over here so this is a home page so where i need to scrape it so what i said i want to select it as a sultan palette it is nothing but a medicals so if i just try to click on to the scrap now so if i just select this particular button scrap so once i start scrapping you can see the page is getting reloaded so if i just show you in the terminal so you can see what happens here is so there is a chrome driver so which will be taken as a uh for the scraping purpose you can see the development tool is using on this particular port number for the chrome driver and data will get scrapped accordingly so as you can see so you can see we got the first data is getting scrapped from the particular location you can see 4.3 6 review pharmacy all the data and it is closed open at 8 30 and we are getting all the data you can see the second data has been getting scraped inside the terminal so this is all the process will be happening inside this one so i'll be showing you the in the administration panel so i'll just come back to again i'll just activate in the another port number so that i no need to disturb the particular first server so which is running at the port number 8000 so i'll just activate it from here so let's tell cd project so i'll just tell python manage.py run server so i want to run the server at the port number 5500 now so if i just run the port number at 5500 so you can see the development server will get started 
So now what I'll do here is I'll just show you the particular report number 5500 and I'll just open the administration of it. So once I open that site of administration, so you can see here if I just click on the scraping data, so as you can see the data has been getting scrapped. So till now, so you can see three data has been getting scrapped over here. So if I show you, so you can see the data has been getting scraped over here. So that's Sakshi Medical and the Sri Manja, Sri Maruti Medical and Suraksha Medical. So if I show you in here, you can see will be first one is what uh, here you can see the Vishal Medical is been scraped first, and you can see uh, Mohit Medical and uh, then one more is the Suraksha Medical. As you can see, the same data has been getting scraped. You can see Sri Maruti Medicals and you can see Sri Lakshmi Venkateshwara Medicals. So same way here you can see if in the port number if I again refresh it. So you can see again you can see till now there is a data has been scrapped so you can see how many data has been getting scrapped till now so the data has been getting getting scrapped uh, at the live you can see nine google maps data has been scrapped till now so this is how we can uh, just uh, start scraping the data so if i again if i just uh, refresh this particular page so you can see now the 11 is been selected so there's the 11 data has been getting scrapped you can see all the data has been getting scraped uh, inside this particular uh, database so this is just i am just showing to print you so this is just the, whatever i have printed it is been showing inside the terminal but the data will be getting stored over it will be getting stored inside the uh, particular database if i refresh the page you can see till now 13 data has been selected as i shown you so there is there is a 14 uh, location data set i have been provided so all the 14 locations data will get predicted inside over if i refresh it you can see the 14 is been selected so all the 14 data set is been selected so let's go back to the same page so you can see once the data has been getting scraped so i'll be getting an option like click here to download the particular scraped data set so i'll just uh, stop this particular server so which i have shown for you for the example so now we got the particular result so you can just click here to download the particular data set so if i just click on to this particular uh, link so whichever i have been uh, downloaded you can see i can download the excel sheet format the particular uh, scraped data so you can see all the data has been getting scraped over here so you can see all the data has been scraped so that is nothing but uh, uh, the id we, have, we got the particular id for it and uh, we got the place address average rating total reviews phone number website categories area status and the uh, status has been all the shops has been closed because right now it is a uh, very early morning so data has been stored so once the particular uh, data is been getting stored so we can see all the the particular uh, status of this website so now let's uh, scrape it for uh, one more uh, thing so for the one more uh, particular location so if i just come back here so now i want to scrape it for one more uh, set so for, suppose i want to scrape it for elanka that is nothing but i want to uh, scrape it for elanka medicals so now we'll scrap for the elanka that is the uh, medicals so i'll just click on to the scrap data again so once i click on to the scrap data so you can see the development server will get started again so the particular it will uh, start listening at the port number uh, this one so you can see the first data will get uh, scraped from the location so we have the uh, number of locations for the you can see the elanka medical and it is closed and it will open at 9 30 am so basically you can see the first data has been getting scraped so same process will happen so all the locations the we have i think i have added some 13 to 14 data set inside the administration for the elanka so all the data set will get uh, all the location will be taken as the input and the data set will get uh, scrapped inside the terminal so once the data get is getting scrapped and uh, we'll be uh, getting the results uh, like uh, we can check the particular predictions of it so let's uh, predict for this particular data set so what is the predictions whether i can open a medical at the elanka or a not so let's the data get uh, scraped so let's uh, wait for one or two minutes it will just take time to scrape all the data from the google maps so you can see all the data has been getting scraped so if i just come back to the pro so you can see i'll be getting the particular uh, the check result so i can just uh, particular check the particular result from here so that is nothing but i can just do the pre-processing status as well as i can just uh, do the random forest and i can predict with the knn prediction so if i just click on to the pre-processing status so before that i need to click the particular download the uh, script even i can just download the particular script data so you can see all the data has been getting uh, stored so we can see all the data has been there so before we did for the sultan file now you can see we have done for the lmk that is the nothing but for the medicals so we have all the things so like the data has been in script so even you can check with the cross verification with the particular google maps all the data will be perfectly here so let's uh, do the prediction for this particular data so if i come back here if i just click on to the pre-processing status so you can see i'll be getting the particular in the data analysis uh, that is nothing but the 10 shops are open and uh, two are closed 
with the all the things so you can see we have the particular uh, so if i open the stop in the alanka it will be failure of 64 percent might be there are a number of medical shops over there so it is from the where it is coming from the particular prediction that is nothing but uh, from the pre-processing if i just click on the random forest predictions so you can see we are getting a model accuracy is a 50 percent we are getting it so success rate is 50 percent with this particular uh, prediction with the random forest and if i click with the prediction for the knn predictions so same way even we are getting the 50 percent with the knn also so it is like uh, according by taking this particular decision we can decide whether we can open a medical shop at the alanka either we cannot so because of this particular data as you can see a number of shops are there over here so it is everything is working fine over there with the particular populations and uh, with the particular average rating is also fine as well as the reviews so based on that the predictions will happen so this is a 50 percent is the success rate if we open the medical shops at the particular location so this is all about the project and uh, so this is how all the we'll think we can uh, predict the particular business the administration so if i show you that uh, this one uh, google script you can see tool is being selected so in the database same we are having a tool medical shops over also here so this is the project of uh, my final year so you can see all the users will be scan over uh, see inside over here so we have the correct functionality with the administration part so this is how the things works inside the project i hope you like this uh, video share subscribe to your subscribe to my channel share with your friends so if you want uh, this particular project you can just comment it down below in the comment section box so thank you